The Internal Revenue Service IRS is contemplating reclassifying certain non-fungible tokens NFTs as tangible collectibles, potentially leading to higher taxes for sellers. Presently, NFTs and cryptocurrencies are treated as property for federal income tax purposes. If reclassified as tangible collectibles, net profits from NFT sales would be subject to a 28% tax rate. To determine if an NFT represents ownership of an already defined collectible asset, the IRS plans to use a look-through analysis. Taxpayers have until June 19, 2023 to comment on the proposal. Notice 2023-27 indicates that the Treasury Department and the IRS plan to issue guidance on treating specific NFTs as collectibles under Section 408M of the Internal Revenue Code, affecting the long-term capital gains tax rate under Section 1H IRS. In addition to potential changes in NFT taxation, the United States government is examining the broader digital asset space. President Joe Biden signed the Infrastructure Investment and Jobs Act, H.R. 3684, into law on November 15, 2021, which includes around $550 billion in new spending, with $28 billion expected to be paid through expanded cryptocurrency and digital asset reporting rules. This legislation broadens the definition of a broker to include anyone providing services that facilitate digital asset transfers on behalf of another person. This expanded definition is likely to affect U.S. cryptocurrency asset exchanges and digital wallet providers. Starting with the 2023 tax year, brokers of digital assets will be required to report taxpayers' trades and transfers of digital assets on Form 1099-B. These developments suggest that the IRS and the U.S. government have a growing interest in regulating and taxing the rapidly expanding digital asset market, including NFTs and cryptocurrencies. The proposed changes and reporting requirements may have significant implications for taxpayers and businesses engaged in digital asset transactions. As these changes are implemented, it is crucial for stakeholders to stay informed and adapt their practices to navigate the evolving tax landscape.